this race just to stop President Trump. His approval rating with Republicans is currently at 81 percent. Yours is at 25. Your best state is New Hampshire, and even there, two thirds of GOP voters say they would be angry and disappointed if you won. Respectfully, Governor, you have not stopped, Mr. Trump, and voters may wonder how you could possibly become the nominee of a party that does not appear to like you very much. What happened to Israel was dead wrong. What Hamas did was medieval. It was subhuman. It was immoral. And we have to call that out for what it is on October 7th. But to say that that was an attack on America fails a basic test. I mean, Nick, if you can't tell the difference between where Israel is and the U.S. is on a map, I can have my three-year-old son show you the difference. Neither of them could even state for you three provinces in eastern Ukraine that they want to send our troops to actually fight for. Look at that. This is what I want people to understand. These people have, I mean, she has no idea what the hell the names of those provinces are, but she wants to send our sons and daughters and our troops and our military equipment to go fight it. Through look at the blank expression. She doesn't know the names of the provinces. Hello, darkness, my old friend. First of all, Chris Christie also doesn't know what provinces in eastern Ukraine he actually wants us to fight for. Chris, your version of foreign policy experience was closing a bridge from New Jersey to New York. Yeah. So do everybody a favor. Just walk yourself off that stage, enjoy a nice meal, yeah. and get the hell out of this yeah. race. Yeah. And Nikki Haley's campaign launch video sounded like a woke Dylan Mulvaney Bud Light ad talking about how she would kick in heels. At the first debate, she said that only a woman can get this job done. That's what she said. After the third debate, when I criticized Ronna McDaniel after five failed years of leadership of this party and criticized Nikki for her corrupt foreign dealings as a military contractor, she said that I have a woman problem. Nikki, I don't have a woman problem. You have a corruption problem. And I think that that's what people need to know. Nikki is corrupt. This is a woman who will send your kids to die so she can buy a bigger house. Left its seeds while I was sleeping.